global multilateral trading system is under siege. This has very serious implications, especially for small open economies. For Singapore, a stable, well-functioning international trading system is vitally important. We cannot survive other than as an open economy. We rely on the free flow of trade and investments across the world and a common set of rules that applies to all countries, no matter their size. We are once again heading towards a world where protectionism is a default and trade rules are secondary, like what happened in the period between the First and Second World Wars. The economic cost to the world will be very high. The IMF recently estimated that fragmentation of the global economy could, in the long run, reduce global GDP by 7 per cent, cumulatively. 7 per cent is a very high figure, but I think it is a conservative estimate because the reality is probably worse. 7 per cent is the effect on goods and services not traded, but deglobalization will also impact on the exchange of ideas and innovation, technology development and diffusion, as well as capital flows and cross-border financing, all of which add to growth, prosperity and human well-being. As, and these are all vital for economic growth, especially for an open economy like ours.